Opinions on Jeffree Star? Racist. 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 Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a really good day. If you're new to my channel, my name is Sebastian. I welcome you guys with open arms. Girl. Just got a text message. I was like, who is that? Whew. Before I get into the tea, honey, I am struggling today. I have the worst hangover that I can barely even like breathe. It's been, you should have seen me this morning. You know, actually you really shouldn't have seen me this morning. That would, who is this? I don't know who that is. I hate, don't you hate like unknown numbers? Ugh, anyways, you guys, um, as you can tell, I'm a mess, but it's okay. You know, I had fun last night and I guess that's what matters, but I've always told you bitches, if there is tea, it doesn't matter what state I'm in, where I am, what I'm doing, I'm gonna spill it for you, bitch. So lay back, sit down, and enjoy this tea. This was the most weirdest intro I've ever done, but you can tell that I'm a mess. You can tell that we're not connecting. Um, and by we, I mean me like this, you know what I mean? Um, so, Lorraine, okay, girl, I have some tea on Lorraine. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing to this messiness. I will be super grateful, and we would be literally cheetah sisters, right? Because we are sisters. I'm watching it tonight. I actually haven't watched Cheetah Girls in a very long time, but I'm gonna watch it tonight. Anyways, a focus, Sebastian, they probably not, you're probably not even here. You probably already clicked off and you're like, he talks too much. But if you are here, I love you. Anyways, so I, I think it's a Hollywood fix that caught up with Loray Issa and a friend, oh my God, I don't remember the name, um, of their friend. Um, and the paparazzi was asking Loray a bunch of questions and um, he asked Loray about Jeffree Star. He told him about the orgy palette and stuff like that. And then he, well, I guess, this is what Larray said, right? He said, my opinion about Jeffree Star, racist. So, um, I actually, I mean, I know Larray is very like outspoken and stuff like that, but I'm actually very surprised he, he said this. As you guys know, Jeffree is, I mean, sorry, Larray is, you know, BFFs with James Charles. Some people believe that they're dating, but bitch, honey, two bottoms don't make a top. So no, they are not dating. Oh girl, this hangover is real. Um, so as you guys know, they're best friends, right? Oh, bitch, the world is spinning. Um, so, you know, I was very surprised that he actually said the word racist. Um, you know, obviously Jeffree Star does not have the best reputation with a lot of people. And especially, you know, after what I guess Shane and Jeffrey allegedly did to James Charles, Lorray being one of his best friends, of course, is gonna stick up for um, for James in that way. And you know, there might be a lot of things we don't know. A lot of things happen behind the scenes. And you guys have to understand that NDAs are placed, um, you know, a lot of like legal shit is, is done so you cannot say a word. So maybe he also has a lot of info that obviously we don't know, right? So, you know, the friend goes on a, on a, like, a little rant just saying that Jeffrey's racist, 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 and then Issa starts screaming. Um, yeah, I don't know if Jeffrey's gonna say anything. I don't, I don't think he is, but I think, I think this might, um, this might pick up some kind of steam just because when you are best friends with someone and you have a very strong opinion about someone, it usually means, not all the time, but it usually means that the your friend group sees eye to eye with what you are saying and, uh, you know, thinking. So maybe James thinks this too, right? Because I think a lot of people have said that he is a racist. Anyways, you guys, so Lorraine 
went cray cray and he was wearing this amazing mask that I really want. I think it looked super cute. Bitch, listen, I tried. At least I gave you the tea, right? Oh, girl, I'm gonna sit down, watch the Cheetah Girls, and every time you guys subscribe, I get a notification, so I would be very grateful if you did. I love you all so much. Have a beautiful night. Is today Sunday? I don't know. I don't know what day it is, but have a beautiful evening on this wonderful evening. Okay, just FYI, when you're drunk, don't make plans. I have made so many plans last night. I called friends. I did all these crazy things, and now I have like a bajillion plans that we're gonna go to a park and we're gonna um, we're gonna social distance picnic and. <laughs> I gotta go. I love you. Bye.